And I'm here with the leading driver at Delaware this week, and that's Dave Hawk. Ten wins to your credit, Dave, and looking for more? Well, yeah, I'd like to get a win or two today. It'd be nice. I know the horse players always want to know, well, who's your best shot? So I'm going to pose that question to you. Who's your best shot today? Uh, I'd have to say Emperor Sabra. And uh, this filly I got in the fourth grade, she has a little chance, uh, TM's Angel Eyes. Let's talk a little bit about that TM's Angel Eyes. This horse has been racing from off the pace, apparently. Do you ever try to change the pattern with a horse? Well, I'll score her down and see what she's like. And uh, she'll tell me behind the gate if she wants to leave or not. You were introduced to harness racing at an early age by your father, and I know you probably spent some time cleaning stalls, walking horses before you ever got in the bike. Did you always know this is the career move you wanted to make? Yeah, I've always wanted to be a driver. and I mean, I've, I started right at the bottom, cleaning stalls, wrapping legs, and doing it all. And now I'm where I want to be now. I've always wanted to do this, and uh, it's great. Isn't it amazing what can happen from starting at the end of a pitchfork? I always wonder. You know, Dave, you are racing so well right now, particularly the last few years. Is it just age or experience? Oh, I've been around that track a few times and kind of get a little more experience and uh, learn to be more patient in my old age, I guess. And it pays off in the end. How long did it take for you when you started out to become confident in your own ability as a driver? Oh, I don't know. I, the last few years, I've really got a lot of confidence in myself. I mean, driving a good horse helps your confidence a lot too and I've picked up a lot of good accounts over the past few years. Yes, you're able to make those moves with those nice horses. You know, talking about the movement of a race, a lot happens out there, Dave. Do you have to pay attention as much as you can to the whole scope, like maybe horses getting crowded into turns, horses drifting? Oh, uh, you know, I keep an uh, wide outlook on everything on the racetrack, you know. I'm watching every horse out there the whole time. Are you watching your competition all the time before you even go postward? Oh, I'm watching horses score down and, you know, horse catches my eye. I, you know, I might pay attention more to that horse in the race. Hawk watches him like a hawk, I had to say that. Good luck today, Dave. Thanks, Trish.